Even with the significant drop in temperature, the city of Hamilton has issued a cold weather alert and is encouraging those who are vulnerable to seek shelter in various parts of the city, including a warming bus. Hadi Azad joins us live with those details. One more option for people who are struggling out there, Hadi. Hey, Taz. So the city says there are several warming shelters available, but the centers say they're, they're having a hard time keeping up with the demands. It's Kronk, a supervisor at the Cathedral Cafe, says she has been helping unhoused people for over 20 years, but she says the situation is a lot worse. So I don't think I've ever seen it this, uh, this bad. Cathedral Cafe on James Street North has been operating since the last two years. In December, they partnered with St. Matthew's House and have expanded their hours, days and staff to help homeless people. They are now providing two hot meals a day, clothing, hygiene supplies and on-site support. Since last month, the group helped over 2,200 people. Last week, we've been seeing about 170 people a day. We anticipate that might get higher with the cold. The warming centre is funded by the city from December 2023 to March of this year. We always need volunteers and donation of winter clothing. We're going through quite a bit of clothing, especially in this cold, cold day. Executive Director of the Hamilton Hub says staff are heading outside at night to help people in need. We've been outside at night servicing folks in encampment um, and we put out publicly a telephone number that could be reached uh, so that we could attend uh, and help out folks with blankets or whatever it is we could uh, that we had in our donations. Cold weather alerts are issued when temperatures are below minus 15 or minus 20 degrees Celsius. And the city says the best place to be is indoors. Regardless of temperature, the city's winter response strategy remains in effect until the end of March. So right now we have approximately just over 200 people that are living in uh, encampments, so unsheltered individuals. The city says the Westmount, Valley Park and Norman Pinky Lewis Recreation Centers are running on extended hours. Additional supports are available, like a dedicated warming bus, increased hours at the Central Hamilton Public Library, and increased overnight warming spaces. People, and they are outside and cold, try to encourage them to get inside. Our outreach workers are out every day, and they too are trying to do everything they can with our shelter staff to get people indoors. So warming centers are finding it difficult to keep up with the demand, especially with this weather. And they're asking for any donations or volunteers. Uh, so if you're able to help out, Please do. Back to you.